As a psychiatrist, I use this following Are You an Empath assessment that's in the Empath Survival Guide to really evaluate my patients to determine if they're an empath. And why is that important? Because if you're an empath, somebody who absorbs the emotions and physical symptoms from other people, you need to know that because it's going to affect your health and well-being. So some of the questions include, have you been labeled as overly sensitive in a derogatory kind of way? And that's a put down as a child where you're considered overly sensitive. Another question is, are you drained in crowds and require a lot of alone time to revive yourself? That's very important to know that because extroverts and introverts can be empaths, but empaths revive themselves by being alone. Are you sensitive to noise, smells, or excessive talking? Empaths are very sensitive in terms of their sense of smell and in terms of being noise sensitive, and they need to be in quiet environments. And also, do you prefer one-to-one -one interactions versus being in large crowds or lots of people? That's a signature of an empath. So these are some key points and key questions that you can ask yourself to determine if you're an empath so you can make that self-diagnosis.